Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about what's in my handbag because you keep asking for quite a time. I don't know if I ever done this video. Have I ever done this video? So this is the mostly mentioned my day to day kind of bag, which I have worn for many years. And if I travel somewhere or something, usually I take this bag with me because it carries the most stuff from all my handbags. So I'm gonna show you what I pack inside in my jumbo, perhaps large nowadays <laughs> size. What's the name? Anyway, I just came from manicure. I went for a deep red this time. That's the name, deep red. <laughs> anyway, guys, before I get to the back and show you my secret space, <laughs> I want to remind you to subscribe because you know, you know the drill, so we can see each other here every Friday. Don't forget to click the notifications. I post videos every Friday. So let's get started. Yeah, guys, this is like my one of the most favorite bags to wear when I need to like put things in. Sometimes when I just like go for manicure, I take my Bottega Veneta bag with just like cash and phone and sunglasses. But if I like go and live a normal life. <laughs> I will carry this one. There we go. I will show you how it looks inside with all the stuff in. So yeah, I mean, I do have things in, I do. <laughs> um, usually I would not have the spray in full size, but I do have it now. So it is what it is. I should move the camera a little bit down so you can like see the back, you know? So for me, for in summertime, <laughs> anytime actually, but this is big lifesaver for me. I have to have my Excuse me, just checking on the microphone. I must have my spray. I just must have this face mist from Biologic Research. I am addicted to it. I usually carry the small size, but now I have only this one because at the store, they didn't have the store gym. They sell it at Equinox. They didn't have small size, so I got that one. So yeah, iPhone, yes. What is this? 13, I think, something like that. I mean, I have it for two years now. Need to go for a new one very soon. <laughs> I got a picture of us there. I have the same picture there since like 2016. The usual, we all have keys, right? So house key, it's, yeah, I kind of, I kind of need to get home sometimes, right? <laughs> I mean, yes, it's a good idea. <laughs> so my dear friends, because I am, um, person who will lose its mind if I'm if my hands are dry. I cannot live without a hand cream. This one is from Guerlain. Guerlain. <laughs> it's the honey collection. Um, I love this cream. It has a golden tone to it. And it really smells like honey and it's super moisturizing and it doesn't leave like nasty film on the hands and it smells like honey. It does smells like summer honey. Citrusy honey, I would say. That's how it smells. You see, it's almost all. <laughs> no, just kidding. So sunglasses, my dear friends, of course I cannot live it without sunglasses. So. As per science and my experience, lighter eyes are extremely sensitive to sun. So sometimes just like for me, just go to like to the pool or just go to the street from the house. Like I get blind for like minutes, sometimes even 10 before my eyes adjust. So I always have sunglasses, even if it's cloudy actually. And I have the Bottega Veneta, the slight cat eye. And I use this uh, Christian Dior pouch because it's soft. So it's very comfortable and light for the handbag. You know, it doesn't give much weight. I just like swipe things around. Like I don't need to have Bottega Veneta pouch for Bottega Veneta glasses. You know, I, 
I'm not that kind of person. <laughs> At least not in my handbag. Maybe in a closet space, yes, but otherwise I don't. Um, of course, wallet. This is a Dior. It's matching my manicure. Um, this is classic wallet. I also have card case from Bottega Veneta, which I will usually wear when I just like need a card for a like, Bottega Veneta pouch, you know, or small tiny handbag. But if I carry actual handbag, I will have usually this wallet from Dior. It's super old, fits all my cars, um, my three IDs. <laughs> One is from Czech Republic, one is international driving license, and one is from Florida. You know, you can put even stuff in between the packets. Here I actually usually put coins or cash, even it's not very good for that. But anyway, I do that. So this is super old. I got this, guys. 2017, 18, that's when I got it for myself. Yeah, I think so. I think I got it for myself for Christmas, actually. I love the leather. I love the vintage leather. Super cute, super cute. You see, this is this was a handbag name. I don't remember the name of the bag, but I got wallet <laughs> from the collection. So, 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 so. I always have tissues because um, I suffer with allergies, my dear friends, and if I sneeze once, the possibility I will sneeze again is very possible. <laughs> so I always must have tissues. No matter of the size of the bag, there will be tissues. Um, perfume, of course, a travel size. I just got this little, little Coco Chanel. Oh, it's not Coco Chanel. It's Coco Mademoiselle perfume. I haven't had this perfume in my life since I was like 20. So guys, I have to say, this is just, this is just it. And really, you know, my husband has never smelled this. I brought it home and he's just like, what is this? I like it. And I'm like, Mama Chanel, by Chanel. He never smelled this. I'm, I'm shocked, equally as you are, okay? The makeup part. So every time I receive like little pouch, this one is from Guerlain Shopping. I have from Victoria Beckham. I have like many different ones. I just use it for my makeup because I like to have my makeup all together. I don't like when it's running around the handbag and then I'm looking for one thing and I can never find anything. So I always like have it in the back like this. Um, yeah, there was a blush. <laughs> Very talented, you know? This is going really well. <laughs> anyway, my dear friends, this is a blush from Westman Atelier in the tone Petal, the mini travel size. I don't usually refresh like my makeup makeup, but blush I usually like to, you know, retouch. And I just love the size for like traveling. So um, I don't know why I carry this because I don't really refresh makeup, as I say. But if I needed a powder, which I don't carry with me, <laughs> I have this little Chanel, little thingy, guys. How cute is this? Um, I guess I used it once or twice. I don't know when and where, but I love to carry this with me because it's it looks like a lipstick, you know? It's super cute, super cute. Then I have a Dior eyebrow pencil. Eyebrows, 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 eyebrows. I would lose my mind if I messed up my eyebrows somehow. Like let's say I go try on in something in fitting room and I messed up my eyebrows with it and I don't have a pencil in my, <laughs> I would lose my mind. So this is by Dior Brow Styler in uh, 032 Dark Brown love this one because it's super dry so if i have you know living in miami it's hot i have oily skin it still stays on i have it on right now so when i use the anastasia pencil to create the strokes the pencil kind of like gives more natural tone to it or not tone natural blend yeah then i have le labo le Bum. You can really see it, the light is really bright, but it's on the lowest of the possibilities. So anyway, this is just basic 
she butter balm it's very moisturizing and i love this one because it's unscented so let's say sometimes when i have allergies and my nose is peeling you can even like tap it to the nose and it will hydrate you know the skin it will be a little greasy but i prefer that over burning nose honestly <laughs> so i always have lip balm which is simple lip balm not like tinted or you know anything with sparklers or stuff like that absolutely not always very sheer lip balm i must have then i have yves saint laurent by the way i am loving it now i had a little thing with this product right when i got it you already saw the video but i can tell you it's pretty good it's really good still don't love the scent and the taste but the way it looks on the lips this dior shine i mean yves saint laurent shine lip shine love shine love shine in the peach tone i love it it's it's really nice i was going to buy other tone but i keep going to the same tone on the peach so i think i picked the correct color for myself altoids because i like to sneeze like i mentioned i always have altoids somewhere and at the moment of the moment favorite lipstick which is the one from Guerlain, i love the mirror I just love this so much. I think it's so, so, so cute. I really love this lipstick. I just adore the color. And of course I had to go for the, you know, what's the name of this packaging of the color? Damn, not turtle. <laughs> you know what I mean? But anyway, I love that it has mirror because you know, if you need to like quickly retouch your lips, you just do it very fast it's fantastic you don't have to pull up your phone and look to your phone you know it just it's very you know like you know what i mean nobody knows what you're holding it's so cute and i like it really a lot and i love the tone of the lipstick don't know the name but <laughs> it's in my previous videos okay <laughs> so that's the makeup part what else we have here this little brush hair brush from mason person switzerland i have two of them i don't know where is the other one at the moment i've been looking for it for two weeks now <laughs> and usually i carry mirror here as well don't know where it go i think i was having um, the other channel back with me the other day usually i have band-aids here as well i took it off very very good the let's see if my love letter pocket has a cash which it does i always carry at least minimum 20 dollars used to be 100 now it's 20 time change <laughs> i could spending the cash i use it uh, for manicure for tipping so yeah <laughs> and who loves to go to the atm machine honestly who who does i don't i don't enjoy going to the atm machine so and that's it my dear friends as you see the back is empty now much lighter now overall this bag is heavy it's not light bag because it has a lot of metal on it um unfortunately it does but this all fits and once you wear it on a shoulder you know it's comfortable so yeah so that is what i carry inside of my bag <laughs> anyway guys i am in love with this red nails lately i don't know what's going on I'm a little bit over the classic um, of white because I feel like it's a uniform in the States. Everybody is going for the white tones. I love chrome still, but the white tones like cream white, milky white, transparent white and different shades of like pink, milkshake and things like that. So I'm lately loving the red. It's my second time. So anyway, guys, so I'm going to put all this back to my handbag which is a Chanel Jumbo. I'm loving it forever. This is not going anywhere. It's here to stay. Yeah, so that is it. I mean, I carry a few things in my bag, but I don't think it's like a crazy, crazy amount of stuff. What do we think? I don't think so. I'm by the way wearing the shirt I mentioned in my previous video, the linen shirt. This one is in extra small. I have a white and small. But I like the fit of the extra small and I tied it up with my silk skirt <laughs> and I just love the look. It's very, you know, 
European, which we don't see much in Miami, you know, very little bit, very little bit. Anyway, my dear friends, so this is it. I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to link the products, some of the products. You don't need me to link in my tissues, right? Um, <laughs> I will link them below if you're curious about exactly it is the piece I have inside of my handbag. So be free to click and look because, you know, sometimes I know previously on the beginning of my YouTube channel, I did not really link the products. Because, you know, I was busy. I had a full-time job, so I didn't have the time to, like, you know. Sometimes I was adjusting the videos till, like, 2 a.m. And then I had to wake up at, like, 6, you know. So I didn't have the time before. Maybe I can go back and do it. Anyway. <laughs> don't promise something you don't mean, right? <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. And i see you next week. Bye-bye.